This is the Bailey Bridge that has been make that has been made by the army right now for all the operations uh, that are going on in this particular place. Where I am is Churumala. Before I start telling you about this place, let me show you this particular bridge that you can see on my uh, right hand side, which my camera person is showing you. This was the first bridge that was used to do all the operations that were going on here, rescue operation. And this is the second worst hit site in this entire incident, which is Churumala. You can see the devastation in this place. Uh, it, just my camera person, if he just pans around, all, all you can see is an empty barren land filled with boulders and, uh, and a lot of mud all across this place, you can see. Now, this is how the devastation has happened in this particular place. Uh, now, that is the route of the river uh, or the tributary of the river that is flowing from there. And from what I've learned from local is that uh, this was not supposed to be like this. This was uh, a township over here uh, and there used to be houses and there used to be schools and there used to be a uh, lot of people over here uh, and there was no scope for a river to come here. But because of the landslide and because of the cloud burst that happened, it burst open there and the water flew here. Now this is uh, on my right hand side, uh, left hand side uh, where you can see a JCB working around is a school where uh, they had put a lot of children over there thinking that this would be very safe for them. Huh? But uh, uh, from what we learned is that also got swept away. Now this is one particular spot uh, which I'm telling you about. But like this, this entire place is filled with such spots where people have lost their lives. Uh, and this particular bridge, that makeshift bridge that was made uh, by the army is for uh, rescue operations like this where big boulders and big materials are not able to move. Uh, so they have placed this bridge. Now you can see this is happening here. Now this particular place, if I tell my camera person to turn around and show you where this particular spot, where you can see a lone JCB. Now there used to be three temples over there. One Shiva temple, one Ganesha temple is what I have been told. But today you can see that it's just ruins uh, that is left over there and nothing else. So this is how the devastation uh, was uh, in this particular place from where we are. Uh, now this particular JCB has, uh, uh, is, was able to come through this is because of this bridge that was made. Till yesterday, this bridge was not there and it was very difficult for them to have, uh, to keep the movements around. But now because of the bridge, they are now able to move across to other denser places where rescue operation is still going on. But with the devastation that we've seen, with the sludge that we've seen, the boulders that we've seen, it is getting difficult and difficult for the rescue operations to continue their work because they have to dig up the entire place. They have to dig sand close to 10 feet to 8 feet uh, to get bodies out. So as of now in this area, they feel that they've done their kind of work and they are moving forward to other places where they feel that there are more bodies or more people that can be rescued over there. For now, from Churumala, from this Bailey Bridge is Mahinder and Waji for TV9.